This morning, investigators on the hunt for any possible accomplices in the Garland, Texas terror attack. The FBI scrubbing through the two deceased gunmen's electronics found in their Phoenix apartment, searching for any clues that may connect Elton Simpson and Nadir Sufi to other terrorists in Phoenix and across the country. But one law enforcement official says investigators did know Simpson was openly communicating online with members of ISIS overseas and even opened a new investigation into both men in recent months. I think from an intelligence standpoint, what's difficult is to move that quickly and to arrest him when it's not entirely clear that he's going to do it. And we have a lot of people on social media that are saying these kinds of things. Simpson apparently had public exchanges on Twitter with this prominent British-born ISIS fighter and a U.S.-born Al-Shabaab fighter in Somalia, Mohammed Abdullahi Hassan. Just a week before the attack, Simpson tweeted in reference to the controversial event, when will they ever learn? Hassan retweeted his tweet and later wrote, the brothers from the Charlie Hebdo attack did their part. It's time for the brothers in the U.S. to do their part. According to U.S. court documents, Hassan traveled to Somalia in 2008 from Minneapolis to join the terrorist group Al-Shabaab. Court records also suggest Simpson wanted to join the jihad in Somalia around the same time, but it is not known whether Simpson and Hassan knew each other. This is something that the United States government uh, has been focused on uh, in both of these issues, both in terms of foreign fighters uh, as well as efforts that are underway by extremists, including those inside ISIL, to use social media to try to radicalize individuals and inspire them to carry out acts of violence. Now, CNN is also learning that the guns who were that were used in the attack and also were found in the vehicle, according to an official with knowledge of the investigation, those guns were purchased legally. Back here in Phoenix, the officials who did scrub the apartment, well, the uh, apartment was relatively barren, but there was a hard drive recovery there trying to get some material off of that.